Okay, this is the last video in the series. Like I talked about the front cover, the back cover, and the label all need to work together. And so the label is pretty much the easiest one to work on. Um, so I can click on the label here. I'm just on the uh, graphic design modules page. And to upload the cover, the CD cover design, um, you need to click on this logo. Or I'm sorry, I'm sorry, this link right here. And this is a link to download this blank template basically so you're going to download that and then you're going to use that just to open that up so click on that and it'll open up in photoshop for you so it's just your blank 12 by 12 square with a like album cover and then you can put over um something that i didn't really go over so something that is um on this is back here on the requirements here the CD label, that one thing that the CD label does not have, it does not, you can have as many, doesn't matter how many layers you have. Like you can have tons of layers or just have one. Uh, so there's no requirements there. But the requirement is that you use the label, this label thing, this label thing to use as a clipping mask. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to do that. So I'm just going to insert any kind of image, so like just place embedded. And I can choose uh, maybe my, um, let's see, what I do? I uh, just been to city, you know. So I'm going to make that larger so I can see. see it. Okay. So whatever kind of image you want to. It doesn't have to be round. It can be a square image, whatever you want. So then you need to have the shape on the bottom, and you need to have the image on top, whatever image it is. And then you're going to click on Layer. And I'm sorry, uh, yeah, create clipping mask, okay? So what it does is it clips it out based, based on that shape. So now for I can actually, if I don't like the placement of it, if I have to have that layer selected, and I can click on move, and I can still move that around. And if I want to resize it, I can just go to edit and free transform, and then have the resize option, you know. It will show the black image if you get to that edge of your uh, image there, but um, you still have the options to edit that image because this is uh, on the certification uh, test we've learned about non-destructive edits. So clicking mask is not non-destructive. So instead of me actually deleting this out, I can use the clipping mask and it's non-destructive. Like I'm not actually deleting part of my image there. You can see it's still there, okay? And when you're done, you click check mark. So let's say I'm, I'm finished with that. So I click file. And save as. Now I want to save it as JPEG, like we done with the other two. And click on JPEG here, and I would actually name it. I can leave it my blank, uh, my CD label outline if you, you know, right there. And save there. And now we're gonna go back and turn it in. So I'm just going back here to um, my start assignment here, and click on upload, and choose, and I choose my blank. I line not the Photoshop one, but the JPEG one, right? That we just saved. So we click open and we click submit, and that will finish that assignment. So we just could turn in the three things, have it all be. And this is uh, this is the link right here. This second link is a link to the same kind of uh, Google Drive folder with a bunch of different examples that you can see there. All the CD labels kind of like kind of work with that, like this one, that's Drake here, the picture of him. You got like the the back cover, which is actually the list of songs. And then the CD label is, you know, a picture of Rick. And they just added some text on it and they use that clipping mask. And they also added the, the owl there to kind of tie that together. So all three of these things, one, two, and then some Drake, I'm using an example. Those are all tied together. Like uh, the Spider-Man, this is the front logo at the front. This is the back has kind of like, you know, into the Spider-Verse thing. Um, and then the list of songs, and then like, um, oh, I'm not sure where the city is. I got lost in here somewhere. Anyway, so it is all kind of ties together over there. Okay, so uh, that will finish that. Uh, yeah, we turned it in. Okay.